What's good, my man and society? It is your host with the most, Shadow Look. Back at you with another video. Make sure you guys like, comment, and uh, subscribe to the channel. It's absolutely free. That is how you help my channel get into the algorithm. Highly appreciate you. Go ahead and do that. Now, what I wanted to get into was actually something that um, I was asked about, right? And I actually see happening a lot, right? Which is um, they notice that a lot of the homie channels or street channels, they get a lot of trolls, right? And that um, also that a lot of people get exposed and that you know, why is there so much negativity when it comes to this kind of, you know, genre? And that's for the simple fact that this genre is nothing but chaos and um, negativity. That's why you get nothing positive about living this kind of life. It comes with the territory. Now, you have to keep in mind, a lot of people do not like people from the streets, you know, criminals, gangsters, all of that. They're not people that are liked. So society doesn't like individuals like that. You know, and on the Internet... You are in their environment, right? You don't know who these people are, right? These trolls or, you know, individuals out there, right? This is their domain. This is their stomping yard. And now these individuals try to come in here and try to punk people or try to bully people around and threaten them and try to scare people on the Internet, which is stupid in itself, right? Because no matter what you say on here, at the end of the day, it's all talk. You can't be gangster. You can't be tough on the Internet. You just can't. Because anybody could come on here and say whatever they want and portray to be whatever they want. Don't make it true just because they're saying it, right? Um, and that's just how the internet works, right? So you can't threaten somebody through the internet. I mean, you could, but it's not gangster. It's not tough. It's not You're not wowing nobody, right? Um, because that's not what the internet's for either way, right? So for individuals to be coming on here and trying to you know, portray this image or try to get people to see them as tough individuals. But this is not something that's new. As long as the internet has been around, you have individuals that have, you know, try to, you know, portray this to be so, right? You know, these Ashita Kims and Count Dantes and, you know, other individuals that claim to be, you know, mixed martial art champions and ninjas and all that. And it turned out to be, you know, baloney, right? So then you have now individuals trying to portray the tough guy role again. And not just with this genre, but other genres as well, right? Seeing the strength cartel, their fiasco, right, with, you know, Joey Stacks. You know, but trying to be tough on the internet is just not going to go good. Because, one, why would you want to look to do that, right? You're not seen as actually tough or nothing like that, right? It's just seen as comical and, and ridiculous at the end of the day. I don't understand why anybody would try to, you know, desperately try to get people to see them as tough on here, right? By telling their stories to try to impress them. Like, if that's supposed to impress these individuals, right? Individuals, you know, petty, you know, immature and stupid behaviors. Because at the end of the day, that's what it is. You know what I mean? Um, so they come on here and they try to, you know, throw this weight around in the domain of these trolls, right? They're going to get eaten up alive, right? Because the, the trolls are not going to be intimidated by these individuals' words. You know, and, you know, homies, you know, have a hard time accepting that, right? You just have to understand that, you know, people are going to think and say whatever they want. And you just got to, you just got to accept that, bro. You know what I mean? Because at the end of the day, you know, why are you so desperately trying to convince these people to see you some type of way? You know, if you already know that that's what you are, then why does it bother you so much that of these individuals? That's why I, I never come on here and try to portray this gangster role or, or I never come on here tell my war story and stuff like that. I'm not looking for people to see me as gangster on here. I could care less about that. What am I going to get out of that? Nothing. Not a damn thing. You know? So why why would I let you do that? You know? Like, I know who I am, so. You know what I mean? So other individuals have a hard time, right? And they argue with people in the comments and delete comments and they go back and forth. And, and it's a battle that they're never going to win, right? Because they don't understand, bro, that. You know, you may get views and stuff like that, but not everybody that's viewing you likes you, right? Other people just want to see you fail. Other people are there just to troll, you know? So don't let all those numbers get to your head, right? Or go to your head. You know what I mean? Um, you know, because a lot of individuals are just watching just to see, you know, hoping you slip. That's just the way it is. You know, that's just how the internet works. You know? I think, you know, when individuals, you know, are, you know, realize that, I think it'll become a lot easier for them on here, right? 
even though, you know, people will see like, nah, because if people are going to see you as soft or whatever, like I said, people are going to view you like that regardless, bro. So why entertain the shenanigans, bro? If you know they're not true, unless you think there's some truth to it. <laughs> you know, because you see a lot of people on, come on here and try to convince people to see them as tough or gangster or these badasses. When on true reality, bro, these people could give a fuck less, bro. That information is not going to do nothing for them. So why should they care? You get what I mean? You know, but like I said, this is not something that's new. You know, people have been, you know, bragging and wolfing all these tales of being, you know, these badasses since a long ass time. For a long ass time. Don't make them true. Makes them, makes them individuals insecure. And that's just the facts of things, you know what I mean? Because right here, people could portray and say whatever they want. Don't make it true, right? You know, so why, you know, in the real world, that's where it counts. That's where you should be leaving your statement, not on here. You know, when it comes on who you are. Because right here, people could say whatever they want. And like I said, this is the tr troll's domain. They're going to find out the truth regardless. Because they got nothing but time. You know what I mean? That's why it's never good to lie. You know, because when you lie, the chance of the truth coming out is high, very high. You know what I mean? So like people just got to be honest with themselves and who they are and, you know, stop trying to convince people to see them as these tough guys because at the end of the day, tough guys don't count for anything, bro. And those stories, even though they're your stories, don't mean nothing to these in everyday individuals out here. That information don't do nothing for them. And you're not really scaring nobody on here. So it's irrelevant. But overall, you know, that's why I just don't, you know, dive in, you know, and go into that, down that lane, right? Because for what? <laughs> yeah. Only those that are insecure, I can see why they would want to do it, right? But we know who we are. But that's just my opinion. What do you guys think? Leave it in the comments of Shadow We Are.